up everybody welcome to my garage hope you're all doing well hope you're all crushing life now i got crushed in the workout this morning but we're mostly recovered we're back because we have a big day ahead we're gonna effectively ruin and destroy a seventy thousand dollar hellcat not really but kind of we're we're cutting it and drilling and putting house screws into the hellcat today also not much has happened there speaking of which we should take a couple minutes to keep plugging away at this but um yeah, uh, that's not gonna happen. Now we gotta jump in the Bentley to head to James's warehouse, but on the way we gotta make a stop because I'm gonna star in a workout video, kind of. You'll see what I mean. But I do need to take a minute to thank today's video sponsor, Exter Wallet. If you don't have an Exter Wallet, this is the wallet of choice. Right now through November 27th, they are having a Black Friday sale with 35% off site wide and up to 40% off on selected bundles. This is seriously the coolest wallet out there and it's super functional. We'll click at the button, you can have quick, easy access to six of your cards, and you can store up to nine more on the back of the wallet right here. I obviously chose the carbon fiber edition because it's carbon fiber. Also, we need more carbon fiber on the vet. We're working on that. We will get there. We're in fact going to need some of these credit cards to do that, but I digress. Exter is made of super high quality products and has RFD protection as well, and it's so slim, it fits into your pocket super easily. Even your front pocket, you don't even notice it's there. They have so many other different styles and choices for you to choose from as well. Including leather and aluminum options. So take advantage of the Black Friday sale and get that Christmas gift for your father, your brother, your cousin, your friend, your sister, your mom, your aunt, or if you're like me and sometimes you buy your own Christmas gifts just as a secret, hook yourself up. I can honestly say this is my wallet of choice and I will continue to use it going forward. And the quick card access function, it's immensely satisfying. So make sure you hit the link below because right now through November 27th, Exter is having their biggest sell of the year, up to 35% off site-wide and up to 40% off selected bundles. Thanks again to Exter for sponsoring this video. Make sure you hit the link below. Let's go. I'm gonna enjoy it while I still got it, if you know what I'm saying. And yes, it truly does smell magnificent every time I get into it, even to this day. Seatbelt, please, if you would be so kind. Thank you, sir. We're not gonna go into sport quite yet, although I just realized we don't wanna be in drive because that's the garage. We're gonna, we're gonna start off in reverse. It's that kind of day. And backwards, there we go. Okay, we're on it. Good job. Okay, now we go into drive and forward ho. Okay, so the reason I'm back in the sweats is even though we just worked out, we're actually going to work out. Yeah, we're going to hard body. Yeah, I think this is an appropriate parking spot right next to the uh, little truck. Hard bodies gym. Again, here we are, hard bodies, looking fresh. I do need a sign like that, that's pretty sick. He actually made that sign, so maybe he'll make me a sign. Can you make me a sign, bro? Oh, yeah, I can make you. Um. <laughs> <laughs> so this, folks, is hard bodies. I don't think I've given y'all a full tour. This is an epic gym that Johnny built, just actually opened a couple months ago, just been super recent. So obviously he does not mess around here. He's got a lot of heavy equipment. I don't quite qualify, I'm not quite big, enough <laughs> this guy he's yo maybe one day i'll be strong enough to be a member but if you are interested hit him up he's accepting limited supply of members because he wants to keep it chill yep which is the best part of gym so i'm here to help him teach you all how to bench press yes you are my guinea pig not because i'm an expert but because i'm terrible and he's gonna make me better so anyways we'll catch you later if you want to see that you got to check him out also i just realized look how ridiculous these shoes are this is this is what people see that's just life decisions right there what's up all right we're off of the three what would you take we got the supra suzuki bentley i think we all take the suzuki obviously all right you know how we roll casey so you're done right i told everybody that i was late that you were working on it and that you would be done by the time we showed up so we're done yeah we're totally done we're done we're cut we cut we've, we've cut we've riveted everything's installed take a look folks what do you guys think uh, finished version <laughs> wide body kit this is dope uh, what about wheels i thought you got wheels oh i forgot them at my house wheels aren't on me right that's on you yeah 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 it's not my fault well, at all i've been here literally 30 seconds casey already wants help i'm not here to help we all know that that's one piece that's a big piece that piece. that's a the hellcat's that's a big car you help. okay i got you i got you all right this is crazy Set it down a little bit gentle i know it's the weekend and i know i'm here to work with you casey but uh, day job doesn't stop even though it's the weekend i got some stuff to do just Keep on keeping on. We're gonna <laughs> drill holes in this. I got emails. Casey's gonna drill holes. We're gonna do some emails. Best of luck.
Dude, what are you talking about? I just had to do a couple emails. I just had to drill a couple holes. You're telling me like we're hooked up, we're buttoned up. Like this, can I yank on it? Not too hard, but yeah. Whoa, oh, 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 okay. That's actually substantial, that's. So think about this. We do the coolest ghetto wide body build ever. We got screws in there right now, they're not rivets. Yeah. We spray paint the wide body kit, kind of overlay onto the car, and we call it good. We'd be done, done tonight. We could. We could be done yeah. tonight. Sponsored by Home Depot. Home Depot, call me, we can work something out. Now I do have to say this, what's totally crazy is this right here, just total anxiety makes me nervous. This is a $70,000, $72,000 car, and we're just like cutting holes in case he's, he's like, whatever, bro. We're gonna put a house screw in the side of your car like it ain't no thing. Well, it is a thing, I'm thinking $72,000 got 72,000 holes. But this right here is why I've got Casey doing the work because if I tried to do it myself, first of all, I don't have the time with my day job. That's the priority. Secondly, I would be so stressed out about every single like hole and cut that it was all lined up that I would never go anywhere. It takes a special breed. It takes a special human to be able to work on a car because it's, it's reversible in a way, but never really fully reversible. You know what I'm saying? So if you're one of those that can drill and cut holes in your car, I respect you. I just hope you did it right. Measure it twice three times just to be sure a friendly reminder to everyone as well obviously the kit's gonna come off we're gonna get painted and all that stuff but the yellow bumper protectors yes we are gonna put those on underneath just for like I feel like it's appropriate you should bury them with the vehicle not that we're gonna bury the vehicle we've done that once we're never doing that again I should mention as well there's a reason we're putting in house screws obviously everyone watching is an expert they know why but for the one person that may not know we're putting in house screws because they're temporary and they just hold it because we're gonna do rib nuts obviously is what what you do permanent but this is a temporary hold because we got to get everything buttoned up because we're going to cut in this video yeah and then you can just take out the house screws get everything painted and so forth so that's am i right you're right okay 100%. that's why you're an expert now. house screws yeah and yes just in case anyone is curious we went with the phillips as opposed to the slotted They're exterior screws so we could just leave them in, right? Yeah, they don't rust. No rust. Phillips, those are the best screws to put in your car. I do have to mention this kit is coming together super nicely. We really like how snug, pristine it's fitting. However, we are gonna have to do one thing, one bit of customization. The camera, the backup camera, is in the stock spoiler there, but obviously in this kit, there's no spot for it, so we're gonna have to cut that hole. We're gonna have to customize the, uh, build it out. Ka Casey's gonna do something to make the camera work. We need the backup camera. Last thing you need to do, do a sick build, not have a camera, and back into a fire hydrant. I've never backed into a fire hydrant in my entire life, except for that one time. And it was a Honda Accord, so we're okay. The other thing that's crazy is the amount of prep work that goes into putting a body kit on, but the actual time to like just do what we've done today, we haven't been here that long. Like I've only been able to do a few emails and he's already pretty much got everything done. We're just doing the wing here and then we're gonna cut, right? Yep. We're cutting. Cutting, that seems hardcore. But drilling holes and putting household screws in your car is not hardcore. I, I don't know why. Also, look at this right here. Look at this. Look at that. Look at it. See, I'm trying to work out in the mornings. You guys are saying this guy is a lifestyle. Yeah, I've been to the gym three times this month. I go to the gym three times the entire month and I look like this. That ain't good. All right, next steps, we're actually gonna take the bits off because we gotta do that in order to cut. So Casey has already marked where we need to cut. So now removal and then cut, correct? Yeah, I need a hand again. I, I work, I work, I work. We got this, no biggie, no biggie. Just gonna remove some household screws from my $70,000 car. Come on, come on, come on, yes. This is a straight up race. We're gonna see who can do more. Start counting. I got two and he's done. Yeah. Alright, now that we've got this one side removed though, here is the outline 
that's how massive that is and then this is obviously the internal cut it's it's not super crazy we're not cutting a ton but still it's a legitimate cut and it's going to forever change the vehicle all right well in case he gets his cutting gear on i'm gonna kick back relax and just uh watch the show we're about to get loud we're about to get real he's got the glasses he's got the ear protection as well see i have my headphones so i can listen to my cutting song the <laughs> cut. first cut is the deepest that's right show crow first cut is the deepest casey is learning here we go ready This is it. We've built this up over three videos. This is what we get. This is all the viewers get. Come on. If you guys have been watching my channel for a long, long time, this should be about what you would expect from me. A lot of hype and a lot of minimal results. So you're welcome for being consistent. Now that is not a knock on Casey Draper because he's cutting and doing things the proper way. You yep. do bit by bit, piece yep. by piece, but I will say this, I'm really hungry. So I think I'm just gonna leave him here. I'm gonna go eat dinner. Best of luck to you, sir. I mean, maybe I'll stick around for a minute, but- uh, Bring me back some scraps at least. You know when you get home from working on a massive project and you feel that little bit of like relief, like you did some good, even if you were watching and didn't do anything, you still feel a slight sense of accomplishment. And then you walk into your garage and you realize you have another major massive project that uh, you're doing by yourself, which is even worse than watching someone do a project. So we should continue to remove the wrap of the Shelby, but um, I don't know if I can muster it right now. All right, fine. We'll give it the old college try. All right, we're good. You know what they say, you move a mountain pebble by pebble. Let's go move some pebbles. I wish you all the best of luck. Make sure you go crush it. Thanks for sticking around. Peace.